Good morning. I was uh, trying to do a Facebook Live or um, something, but um, for some reason or another, my Facebook was acting weird. I couldn't get onto my page. Uh, MyCrazyLife66.com, uh, spelled with a K and not a C. Uh, but I just wanted to give you all an update on my shoulder. Uh, basically, the doctor said that um, uh, everything looks good. Uh, he did take out the um, the uh, ten uh, staples that were in my arm. Um, I could tell that they were there, uh, and I could tell that they weren't there when he took them out. Um, but anyhow, uh, it is doing good. Um, he said I'll be in the sling for about another two weeks, and that um, uh, after that um, I'll be starting some physical therapy and going through all that fun stuff. Um, I hope this, uh, I was uh, going to do some other stuff, but I just thought I would get to give um, uh, an update here, um, uh, here on my phone, rather than uh, shooting from my, um, my office camera, um, my other computer camera. Um, <coughs> so anyhow, it's live for all and this is what you get. It'll be unedited, and um, and uh, what you see is what you get. Uh, basically, what I've been doing, or what I've been attempting to do, is do some um, um, vlogging uh, where I pull out some emails that I get uh, through various um, um, newsletters and stuff I've subscribed to and um, I'm trying to find one here now I guess I should have already had that pulled up but anyways um, let's see here um, let's do ladders um, basically and I have quite an extensive let's see what works here it's called ladders and they have a variety of emails I've done this on the split screen before with my other com with my other um, on my other computer um, but um, I'm doing it this way today, so you, I might turn around and show it to you. Um, let's see, and they have a variety of topics here. One is seven politeness mistakes you could be making at work. Um, another one is um, that, that nightmare you may had may be the key to figuring out what is stressing you at work. Uh, nine awesome work situations that to make you say yes. And then Abba Wimbach, Justin Tributo, Chadwick Boseman, and more. Check out our round up of great commencement speeches. Let's see. And if you want to start making a better decision, do this. I think we'll read this one here. Um, and it says, tell us your best animal story work, best animals at work stories. And then it gives a bunch of other ones, uh, but I'm not going to read that one. And I received this email. Hopefully, this will open up. But I received this on May 27th, 2018. So we're going to go through and read this other one here. If you want to start making better decisions, do this. Let's see if it opens. Well, I did it one day and it didn't open at all. All right, it's, it opened up. All right. First of all, do you ever look back at the decisions and think, why on earth did I do that? Of course I do. I say that all the time. Um, on things that I buy, things that I do, things that I think, um, I do. Uh, let's see, we all make bad decisions. Buying an SUV that sucks, 
up all your cash. You got that right. Starting a new re a relationship without being in love. I don't know about that, but uh, saying yes to a job that you're not passionate about. Done that. Um, creating products that no one needs. That happens. I've uh, done that. We all make bad decisions. Uh, the above examples are not about me, but the other person, but I have done that. Um, but they're funny things. Bad decisions never seem like bad decisions in the moment. All right. I've been reading about the decision-making process of Warren Buffett. Um, of course, this is an email that I'm reading. And Charlie Munger. Um, the two most successful inventors of all time. Uh, in Alice Schroeder's biography of Warren Buffett, I read that Buffett and Munger have a learning strategy that's based on what you should be should you should avoid doing. They identify mistakes, and they do their best to avoid those mistakes. Let's see what they might be if she tells us. But as Charlie Munger says, smart people do dumb things. Guilty. You can never avoid making a mistake. However, you can avoid making the same mistake more than once. True. Plus, by learning from other people's mistakes, you can all you can make their mistakes. You can make their mistakes your own. That way you'll learn faster. Don't overthink it. Smart people are way too preoccupied with doing the right thing. They want to have the perfect life, career, house, business, car, holiday, and on and on. That's way too much pressure to put on yourself to make the right decisions. I re um, this person recently spoke to a friend who wanted to make a career move. I asked him to walk through with me the dis thinking pro this process. I like the company I work for, but my job isn't engaging me, isn't engaging anymore. I've been working this work for four years, and sure, I've been I've been promoted twice, but it's still the same work. So I've been looking at other companies, but what if I go somewhere else, and that doesn't work out? I'll have to move on quick, and that won't look good on my resume. I remain silent. Just hearing myself talk leads me to other things overthinking. We both laughed at our asses, our asses off. <laughs> Sorry, their butts off. Um, I can do the same with overthinking, and I bet you've been there too. When you've overanalyzed every single decision, you become paralyzed. Result, nothing happens. Now, that's a bad, in, bad outcome. That's how people end up wasting their lives. True. Been there, done that. Uh, the only way you can stop overthinking is making yourself aware of your thinking process. When you ask friends about this thinking, he becomes aware of how irrational his process was. When I asked my friend about his thinking he became aware of how irrational his thought process was. You can't control the future. Stop thinking about it. So stop thinking about it. Do this instead. Make small decisions and decide often. Earlier decisions lead to better decisions. I'm just going to go through and... and um, well, I guess that was the end of it. Anyway, that was two things that she said there, or he said. Um, so, but I'll put this um, link on the um, in the post on the blog also. Um, let me read this here. The earlier you make your decision, the more chance that you'll make better decisions. I often say that there is no right or wrong decisions. Only decisions that are entirely accurate. Are, that's not entirely accurate. Of course, 
there's a difference in the quality of your decisions that's the topic of another article but here's the thing not making a decision is also a decision it's a choice to put things off until another time so in effect you're making decisions all the time instead of making fewer decisions we need to make them earlier because all you need are a few good decisions in your lifetime anyway what will be your best you only have to find out after you guessed it you made the decision that was sort of I guess you know highlights is don't overthink it um, make small decisions and decide often and make early decisions that lead to better decisions um, and that's basically it. like I said I'll put this in the um, in the um, in the info on um, on YouTube and on my um, blog page um, that's all for now uh, I hope you all have a great day and uh, I hope this helps you make better decisions and um, uh, where you know you can move on and uh, if you make better decisions maybe you can um, uh, make more money uh, go on that trip um, whatever whatever it is the decision that you're holding back on uh, you might want to go ahead and just make it and uh, make that career move uh, make that the love move uh, whatever the decision is um, make it now make it early uh, because sometimes if you don't make it early then that decision could be gone forever um, it's already passed um, it's like opening some of my emails sometimes I've opened up a couple of them and clicked on it and looked at the link and it was gone there's no information there it says information cannot be found fatal error 404 blah 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 anyways I didn't make the decision early to look at the email and lost out <clears throat> and um, you know lost out on buying that car um, lost out on uh, that job promotion um, but um, make your decisions early and um, best of luck with that and uh, vlog on and blog on and I will see you uh, in a couple weeks um, hopefully this will all be healed up I'll be going through physical therapy after um, a couple weeks uh, the doctor just wants it to heal a little more and so I appreciate your continued prayers and thoughts uh, for my healing and I hope you all have a great day talk to you later bye